Now, the U.S. government has once again denounced North Korea for using American detainees as leverage to seek its political goal of direct talks with Washington. Speaking at a regular press briefing on Monday, U.S. State Department Deputy Spokeswoman Marie Half accused Pyongyang of using American nationals as human pawns. She was referring to Matthew Miller, the 24-year-old from California, who was sentenced by a North Korean court to six years hard labor a couple of days ago. She called on the North to release Mr. Miller and two other detained Americans, Jeffrey Fowle and Kenneth Bay, on humanitarian grounds. Now, North Korea is widely believed to be using the detained American citizens to try and extract a high-profile visit from Washington. In the past, former U.S. presidents Bill Clinton and Jimmy Carter have visited the country to secure the release of detained Americans.